Hi everyone! I haven't really vlogged in a while and it's been since, gosh, I haven't even, I don't even remember what I put up there on YouTube, but um, I just taught class and it was a, a great after school class. I had third and fourth graders today and this week we're doing collaboration, art collaboration with Eastlake Elementary School and we have a project called Art Box for School Projects and I'm teaching them how to um, create works of art. Well, they already know how to, to draw and color, but I was just guiding them how to um, do the instructions and um, create bold, bright arts artwork for, you know, for them to print on t-shirts and cups and and mouse pads and all kinds of things. They can do all kinds of items and um, what they do is that the paperers go onto a, a website and then the parents are able to order the um, personalized items that their children make. So it's very, um, very streamlined. It's very great. Um, I really like the, the setup and um, I'm really excited to be part of um, you know this this great program to uh, introduce to some of the schools. I already do that in my after school program. Um, we, we, we create works of art on the iPad and we upload it to the Dropbox. Uh, the, the very uh, the very challenging thing is to be the teacher to teach kids how to create actual you know, artwork that is uh, that is graphic design and vectors. That's the challenge. Uh, a lot of schools don't have that unique program, but they do have crayons. They do have um, paper and markers and things like that, pencils and erasers, and you can create the traditional kinds. But you can, um, you know, very limited to what you have in, in, in terms of technology and iPads. So not all the schools have. So, um, some of the schools are, and you know, that's what I do after school, but this one was very great because, you know, all schools have pencils, crayons, and paper, and erasers, so it just kind of suits the kids, and they created the artwork themselves, and they work very hard and very fast, and it is a timed, a timed class, so they had to do a lot of um, designing first, of their sketch and then they had to do it in a marker and then they did it in marker and pen and color to make it a uh, very uh, vivid and eye-catching for the items that their parents will be able to purchase online with their artwork but anyways I am home now on my relaxing massage chair and I have a heating blanket and <laughs> I'm so pampered. <laughs> I have this area in my living room, which is a spa room, and I have um, my VR, so I'm going to be um, listening and watching some beach scenes, and it's just really great to have this. We, we've had this since, uh, it was a Christmas gift for my husband, and I love him very much, and um, get to see all kinds of things so I have to pop this pop my phone into here and then um, you put it on your head <laughs> and it's kind of like uh, goggles when you go under 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 the uh, ocean and the pool so this is what I look like I look very funny, huh? <laughs> you can see my eyes. So, anyways, the um, the phone, the iPhone, or the Note, whatever phone you have, whatever. I think this is only available for certain phones. For but sorry, this is not available for Sam, um, iPhone, but this is only available for um, Samsung phones. So my Note Five will go on this thing here, and then the. Whatever you're watching on YouTube, I heard that there's so many YouTube VR shows, and there are um, there's an app called Oculus uh, VR. I forgot what the name was, but um, you are able to download the app and then watch all kinds of amazing shows on that. So I'm going to relax, and I'm on my massage chair. I'm getting my massage. It's been a very very busy day. 
I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> and then, um, then dinner time. And then repeat, rewind tomorrow. So anyways, I just wanted to upda update you. And um, I hope you all are having an amazing, amazing week. I'll see you guys later. And peace out, baby.